Okay guys, I'm going to show you how to recover lost or accidentally deleted files. Okay. The easiest way is as soon as you've deleted those files, try not to do anything else. Don't be saving stuff on your computer because if you save over where that file was, it's a lot harder to recover. So the quicker you do it, the better success you'll have at retrieving your lost files. So we're going to go to download.com. And in the search download, we're going to type in R E C U V A and press enter. And here it is right at the top. Download now. And save it. It will only take a few seconds to download. And we're going to run it. Next, there's no junk software with this program, so you don't have to worry about it. Just install. This program's clean. And we're going to just run Recuva. Okay, next, and we're, this is what type of file you're trying to recover. We're going to go after pictures, but as you can see, you can go after music, documents, video, emails, etc. So we're going to go after pictures. And I'm just going to say I'm not sure. But if you knew it was in your documents or if it was in the recycling bin, you emptied it, you can click on those and it'll do a search just on that area so it'll be faster. So now we're going to go next. And it's going to search our computer for pictures that were deleted. This search will just take maybe a minute or so. It's very fast. This program is completely free. They do have a paid version, but I've never used it. I've always had great success with just the free version. Failed to scan the following drives. Q access is denied. That's just, that's not a drive. That's for something else, though. We will just ignore that. And here, it'll show you a preview of all the files that it successfully recovered. So, they'll all appear here. You can just keep on going down and I'll show you the previews. If it doesn't have a preview, it means it wasn't recoverable. So, the easiest way to find your files that were recovered and are in excellent condition is just go to switch to advanced mode. And we're going to put this list, see how it says state, unrecoverable, excellent unrecoverable excellent excellent so we're just gonna organize those so all the excellent ones are at the top now another thing to find out if there are actually files you want is to look at where it was any files that are in temporary internet files etc are probably not files you're after to recover there are pictures that were stored in your computer from browsing the internet etc so those ones you won't be interested in so you just go down until you see where there was a file. Now this is a background. That's obviously something I don't care about. AVG. So you just read where the path was and you'll be able to tell if it's your file. And a lot of times it might have the file name right here. I'm not sure if I have any files that I need to recover on here. But see now it's already getting into into very poor state. So if you have a file you want to recover, all you do is you just click on it. That's the file you want. And you just click on recover. And then it will ask you where you want the file to recover to. You put the path you want to recover to. And voila, you're done. When when it's done being recovered, just go to where you, 
you save the two and go open up the new file. Easy. Thank you for watching.